A question that comes up quite often is how do I manipulate or add more to my set menu? All you need to do is go into your menu details, into your items and create that new item. So that's going into add item and filling out the information required. Now, if this item already exists in your menu and you're just wanting to add it into that price point with that set menu, all you need to do is search up that item and then you'll find your default price. From there, press the ellipses, which is those three little full stops and scroll down until you see either price at two or price at three. As a standard, an impulse technician when building your menu will choose one of these two to create your set menu off. And all you need to do there is change the price to free. It's a little tick box that you select. Once selected all five tick boxes, press update. From there, then exit out of items, go into your menu details again, go into your sub list. From there, you'll actually see that there is a sub list called set menu. It might be broken down into set menu entree, set menu main, set menu dessert. Target the specific sublist that you are looking to manipulate or add your item into. Search for your item and simply drag it in and press update. From there, it will actually appear in your set menu. Now, one thing to just ensure is that the price has remained as zero. We do find that fairly often when people are manipulating their set menu that they do not look for this price and they're suddenly their $45 set menu becomes a $48 or $55 set menu because of this price adjustment. To ensure that this is the case, make sure that putting it through in front office to test that it works is a great key point. If it does work, fantastic. If it doesn't, please just jump back into front office, go through your menu details, go into your item, search for the item and ensure that price set two or three is set as free.